Hey guys, uh, we're just I'm just here at uh, Cahers Connell uh, Fort. It's an old ring fort that dates back to about the 10th century. Um, I just thought I'd show it to you guys here. Now the, you can see here, this is the start of the wall foundation that literally goes all the way around. There's a walkway. We're going to go inside as well, uh, just to give you guys a, an idea of the aerial view here. That is what the ring fort looked like, obviously from the aerial from an aerial view perspective. Obviously, we're getting the we're getting the full treatment here. Uh, that's to give you an idea of the actual ring fort. Apparently, in in regards to the ring fort, they did some uh, they updated it. So pretty much from the 10th century, um, that's when the inhabitants first came here, and then it pretty much lasted uh, until about the 16th century, um, which is pretty impressive because the structure itself is basically just a stone wall that goes in a circular um, uh, circumference. And then inside there's some old dwellings and that, so we're going to go and take a quick look. Um, yeah, we're inside the middle here now. Um, as we come around, let's try the selection here. Yeah, so this this is the inside. The uh, uh, the the term cahir apparently in Irish refers to fort. So cahir Cahir's Connell uh, was the term for uh, a fort Connell, where it was the apparently the first inhabitants, the first human inhabitants um, um, that lived in this uh, in this fort. So it would have been it would, probably would have, would have been some form of king or uh, obviously in charge of an area that would have lived here, maybe a chieftain or something like that, and he would have been in charge of this uh, entire area. Uh, they did some archaeological digging around here, so uh, behind me here there's an, there's an older section which is right here, this faint line here, that would have been one of the oldest dwellings actually here in the actual fort. There are uh, the dwellings apparently that are underground here, but they're, they're too deep. Uh, and then we've got a modern 15th, 16th century house over there, that would have been the, probably the last inhabitants here. Um, and then we've got a split here, and uh, apparently they would have used uh, that right in the back section there would have been where they had cattle. Um, obviously, because that would have been their, their sort of prized possessions, and you can call it that. Uh, there's um, some burial. Obviously, where some of the people were buried here. This is some of the. Uh, sorry, that sun is absolutely killing me. <laughs> yeah, so right behind me here is where some of the people were buried. And if uh, I dug up the human human remains, and the carbon dates of them, so even older than this site here. Um, wow, well, it's pretty impressive here, anyway. Yeah, just wanted to share it with you guys. Um, I'll uh, update you with another video shortly. Thanks. Hey guys, um, here we are. We're at the. Uh, this is the dolmen. This is the little. This is actually an ancient burial site. Predates the pyramids, uh, so the structure here. Um, the, a family or a group of people would have been buried in it or underneath it, and then they would have erected this uh, this particular structure here. So um, this one right here, and we're surrounded here. Just this fabulous limestone rock, just everywhere. There we go. How's that? This particular area is called the Burren, mainly for this particular reason, as you've got this limestone sort of rock just laid everywhere. Now this would have initially been the bottom of the ocean at that particular time, many hundreds of thousands of years ago. And obviously as the as the ocean subsided, you would have been left with this limestone. And then all these ridges that you see in the rock here, that would have all been channels for, for water. But yeah, fabulous site. Uh, I just want to give a shout out to all my subscribers. Thanks very much, guys. Um, sorry, the the internet where I am uh, currently staying at is not very good at all. So unfortunately, I can't upload any video. So I'm going to try and upload this along with the previous video, which was at the uh, Cahers um, Cons Fort. I'm going to upload these two together. But thanks very much for watching, guys. I certainly appreciate you all. And uh, I'll be back. I'll be back home tomorrow evening. So what like I'll start off with the next uh, series of videos will probably be beginning of next week. So again, thanks very much for watching, guys. I'm glad to share this piece of history with you. And uh, take care, and I'll see you later.
you on the next video. Hey guys, just a quick one here. This is the this is the burial chamber that I was talking about. This is the dolmen. They refer to it as the dolmen. I think they were saying there uh, five six thousand BC. This was this was put up. So this was before the time of the pyramids. Um, Ireland was full of generally hunter hunter gatherers, but they would take their time and they would have built these monuments uh, would have followed much later to honour their dead. Um, apparently, on this particular site here, they said there's about 35 individuals that were buried here, and then they erected the, the capstone, as you can see on top there. It's a very large piece of rock. Let's see if I can get another image there for you. You need to be careful where you step here because there's loads of gaps. You see these gaps that, uh, that are just down here. <laughs> you can jam your, your leg straight into it. Oh, so there you go. You have the the middle here, right there.